Hello, Gamer Gnome is back. And in this video, we're going to help this noob with the Blizzard Fruit reach max level. But before we start, you can show your support by using Star Code Gamer Gnome when purchasing your Robux. 5% of the earnings will go to me, and this will really help us on making better videos. Where the actor slam on the dancing forward, that's your slam! Okay, so for those who don't know, I already made the Noob to Pro video. Yes, level 1 to 700. I don't want to repeat that same video, the level 1 to 700, so I will make it faster, okay? We will finish it in 3 minutes and continue with the second C. So guys, are you ready? Let's go. First off, you need to level up from 1 to 15 with the bandits. You're gonna use your Z skill to defeat them, guys. Don't worry, Blizzard is an elemental fruit, so everything will be easy, okay? So level 15, next up the Fountain City. First, you're gonna lure Egali Parent, use Wall Strat and Combat for the initial damage and last hit with Blizzard skill, and that is this skill. So guys, target level here is level 60. We will be unlocking a new skill, the Tornado Flight. We're gonna use it to go to the next island, the Desert. And in the Desert, our first target is Desert Officers. Don't worry, no damage. Again, Elemental is in effect. So guys, fast grinding here. Target level is 75. Next stop, at level 75, Desert Officers. So again, same, no damage. So grinding is almost the same with the Desert Officers. By the way, F skill has damage. I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. Guys, we're gonna grind here until level 90. For those wondering where are the stats, here it is. Melee 25, Defense 25, Blood Fruits 220. Next stop, the Frozen Village. Target, the Snow Bandits. Again guys, same strategy, Blog is in effect, we're gonna grind here until level 105. After that, Yeti is the target, check this out guys, F is skill is enough, there you go, guys, it's very easy to defeat, just one skill, he won't be using his skills, I don't know why, but he cannot cast it while you're using this skill. Okay, so we're gonna grind here again at level 130. There you go. After that, next up, Marine Fortress. If you want, you can buy the Black Cape for 50,000 bellies. Head straight, Vice Admiral, target level 220. Okay? Meaning we're gonna server hop. Again, guys, check the level 90 levels. But this is the fastest and easiest way to do it. We're gonna unlock a new skill, the White Out. There you go. So, again, guys, at level 220, we are moving to the next island, the prison. Guys, our target here is level 350. We're gonna do wall strat or F skill if you want. Same with Chief Warden, F skill, and Swan. Okay? We will unlock a new skill here the Howling Wind. Anyway, at 350. Next up, Magma Village. Target, Magma Admiral. Okay. So again, we're gonna server hop here. Okay, as you can see, guys, we defeated him with F skill. So at 425, next up, Underwater City. Enemy is the Fishman Lord. Guys, Wall Strat is our strategy here. So again, Wall Strat server hop until level 500. Okay, after that, Skylands. Whisper is the target. Just use F skill and that is enough. If you want, you can also use your Z, X, and C skill for additional damage. 637. Next up, Fountain City. Target, Gali Pirates. So guys, new skill will be unlocked. The final skill, Blizzard Domain. Check that out. And there you go guys, level 700 at 3 minutes. Okay. Anyway guys, I want you to focus on the V skill, the Blizzard Domain. It's really strong. Just one V skill is enough to burst this Gali Pirates. So guys, take note, we're gonna grind here until you reach level 793. You've skipped lots and lots of quests, but guys, believe me, this is the fastest way to grind. Stat check. Here you go. Melee defense 250, block force 1879. After that, we are ready to head to the second C. Congratulations to us. Okay, so back to grinding. At this level, guys, we are now fit to defeat Swan Pirates. Don't worry, Elemental is in effect. And check this out, guys. Just one V skill and you can defeat Swan Pirates. Okay, if you want, you can use your Z, X, and C skill to also burst them. That will be faster. Your choice. Let's not forget the F skill, right? That was really effective in the first C. So again, when you reach level 925, we are leaving this area. Next up is the green zone. Target is Fajita or Fujitora. Guys, I'm gonna show this to you how powerful the V skill is. There you go. There's just one V skill plus F skill. Check the HP, guys. Less than half 
So you're just gonna need to repeat it. Or if you want again, you can use your other skills and that's it. We're gonna keep on grinding here until you reach level 1028. Why 1028? Because again, elemental effect on the next island. For the stats, melee 250, defense 384, max blocks fruits. Next up, snow mountains. Target level here is snow troopers until 1150. Like I said, no damage here because again, they don't have hockey. So we're just gonna keep grinding here using our V skill or if you want, you can experiment so that you can also enjoy grinding. So guys, at 1150, hot and cold is next. Target is the smoke admiral. We're gonna time this one. Let's go. How many seconds will it take us to defeat this boss? Comment it on the comment section. I'll give you a choice. 15 seconds, A, B, 20 seconds, C, 30 seconds. A okay, comment it in the comment section. And if your answer is, I think it's 20 plus. There you go, guys. It took us 21 seconds. We're gonna do server hop here again until you reach level 1288. After that, her ship. Here, guys, it's very easy. Check this out. Ship deckhands again. No hacky, meaning we can take advantage of our elemental effect. Now we cannot one hit them with the V skill. You need to add some skills like Z or F skill, and that's it. Target level here is level 1394. Next stop, the Ice Castle. Our target, Arctic Warriors. Guys, we're just gonna focus here. We're gonna skip the Ice Admiral. Because again, we're gonna take advantage of our elemental fruit. There you go. So gamer now, what is our target level? Guys, we're gonna grind here until you reach level 1473. There you go. Almost done. And after that, final island, forgotten island. Target, sea soldiers only. Again, only. We're gonna skip the next mob here and... Uh, what they call this? What's the name of the boss? The Tide Keeper. We're gonna skip that too. Because again, log is in effect. Target level 1552. Don't worry, I'm gonna show you the stats after this. There you go. Max, Blacks Fruits, Defense 1650, Melee 556. Guys, don't forget to do the Coliseum quest. Defeat uh, Swan. And also, you're gonna need to fight Indra, right? But it's easy to like damage until half HP. So that's it. After that, head to the green zone, talk to Mr. Captain, and say hi to the third C. Back to grinding. Our first target here, the Pirate Millionaires. Guys, they're very hard to defeat. But if you're using a Logia Fruit, very easy. So first, use Z skill and one V skill. That is enough to defeat them. Again, reminder, no damage here. So don't need to worry. If you, if you want, you can experiment on your own. Okay? Okay, so guys, next up, 1,675, the Hydra Island. Our target here is the Island Empress. So guys, did you miss the wall strat? Yes, we're gonna do wall strat here for us to grind faster. Oh, check that out, guys. Hmm. Oh, it's that Buddha user. Anyway, guys, I thought he's gonna attack us, but guys, check this out. Shout out to this dude. He helped us defeat... The Island Empress, I thought he's gonna attack us after this, but no guys. See that? Okay, so bro, thank you to you. Even though we accidentally attacked him. Thanks, bro. Okay. There you go. Anyway, guys, back to grinding. There you go. Wall strat. Target level here. Again, we're gonna server up, right? 1750. After this, next island, Great Tree. Target is Kilo Admiral. Guys, to be honest, this boss is kinda tanky, but he's very easy to defeat because he has limited attacks. Not like the mobs around this island, they're kinda strong. <laughs> okay, the target level is 1686. After that, guys, I'm gonna show you the stats. I think this is the last time. <laughs> Why? Because we've already maxed our defense and blocks fruits, so all the remaining stats will go to melee. Okay? Next island, guys, the Turtle Island. Our target is the Fishman Captain, guys. Only the Fishman Captains. Why? Because they're the easiest one to grind here. They're near the quest giver. They don't have Haki. As you can see, they cannot damage us. And not like the Jungle Pirates or the Masketeers, guys. They're so far away, okay? From each other and the quest giver. Next stop, Haunted Castle. Target only, guys, reborn skeletons. So here, guys, you can use your V skill to lure them and use your skills to defeat them, okay? No problem here. Again, very easy. 
Also, we're gonna skip the other quests here. But Gamer Gnome, they don't have Logia, guys. But they have fruit, so they can burst you to death. Okay? So at level 2161, Sea of Treats. First Island, Peanut Land. First Target, Peanut Scouts. So guys, if you're in a hurry just like me, use V-Skill plus C and Z-Skill and that's it. One more tip guys, you don't need for the V-Skill to end. Before you use all your skills, just keep on casting your skills for faster grinding. So at level 2200, next up, the Cookie Crafters. So guys, there you go. Again, V-Skill after that. ZXC, if you want to make it really fast, Z, X, and C. There you go, guys. You can burst them really fast, right? Okay, so moving on at 2300. There you go. Next up is the Chocolate Land, not the final island anymore. Target Chocolate Warriors. Again, V skill, right? Jump Z, C, and X. And that's it. See that? Really fast. So we're gonna grind here until you reach level 2400. After that, we will head, guys, check this out. It is not named North Pole anymore, just Sea of Treats. I don't know why. Target here, Candy Pirates. So again, V-Skill, just use your Z, X, and C really fast to burst them. There you go, Z, X, and C. There you go. Guys, we're gonna do our 50 final levels here. And that's it, guys. We're gonna reach level 2450 here. So did you enjoy this video? Comment it in the comment section. Again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I really appreciate you all. Happy New Year. Good luck to us this year. And again, guys, I really appreciate you for supporting this channel. This is Gamer Nom. And see you on my next video. Bye-bye.